Yes, we're now heading to the prison. That's okay. <laughs> Put the sat nav on. So yeah, we're just heading to the prison now. Hopefully, they don't keep me there. It's yeah. an area for me anyway. It looks, looks nice. Yeah. Envigado. Envigado. I don't know if I can say that in my Scottish, my Scottish English. How do you say? Envigado. Envigado. Yes, correct. Envigado, that's where we are. It looks really nice here. Small city. Yeah. The office of Pablo Escobar. Yes, yeah, so Pablo Escobar's office was here. For business. For business, but not anymore, guys. Not anymore. I tell you what, guys, it's a, it's a fair, a fair drive up here. Um, I think this prison was strategically placed. But La Catarral, La Catarral? Yes. La, I think that'll do. La Catarral, that's the name of the area where we're at. But it's a nice little drive. La Catedral. La Catedral. This See, that's the one, yeah. Game the basketball, soccer. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. The decks for. Yeah. Detention people. Yeah. And meeting. So this is now just like a park, like for people to come and sit. This is now like a park, just for people to come and sit and relax. <laughs> yeah. Original house of Pablo Escobar. Room. Room. The original time. Ah, yeah, I can see. The government broke in. Yeah, so the government destroyed yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> big room. No. <laughs> no jail. Yeah, it wasn't like a prison, it was like a big hotel. Uh huh, remember? Yeah. She's a star. Go for him first. Happy yeah. <laughs> for she say <laughs> no lost. <laughs> <laughs> La Catedral y Salto del Ángel. This is jumping of the angel. Ah. Angel. Okay. The name for a small wall of water in the mountain. Okay. Pablo used to sit down here and relax. So yeah, we just took quite a long little trail. Don't know if you can see it on the camera there. This is the people uh, say thank you for the score. Oh, so this is uh, so people come and put these on the wall to say thank you. Especially for the Virgin. Okay. Virgin is the name. Yeah. Virgin woman. The people. Uh, thanks for my life. Yeah. The people who score the same. <coughs> he said, sit down in the place. Special area for Palestine. Yeah, so you used to come down here and the relax. In this area, standing for Palestine. Well finished, working for him. <laughs> so. so yeah, apparently this is a little place where people come and smoke, smoke marijuana. Oh yeah. Tell you what, it's some place so it is. It's about a 20 minute drive to get up here and a big winding road.
So yeah, we've just came to this little spot here. You can hear the water down there. But apparently, apparently this is where Pablo Escobar's sicarios used to bring the bodies. They used to kill people here. That little fly on me there. They used to kill people here, apparently. I'll say apparently because that's what the, the guide Sergio says. But the police did find bodies, or they found remains, human remains here. Interesting place. So yeah, when Pablo Escobar came to this prison, uh, there was no change. Uh, there were still killings and all his usual dealings with uh, drugs, etc. So the Justice Secretary decided that it was time for him to leave this prison and go to a normal prison. Um, so one of his guys who was paying called Pablo and says, look, they're coming for you and you have to escape. And this is this is where he escaped, through these little, these little narrow ways here. Meeting in this area for gain the cheese, cheese for chess, yeah, chess, yeah. Um, different e the night pay, card, card. Yeah. Pocket. So you used to meet here. In this place, have two or three decks in this moment, like destruction. Yeah. What's that mean? Just look at that view of Medellin. Heliport. Yep, the heliport. Say to the government, sorry, but I need this for maybe the enemy. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy that they allowed him to have all of this uh, the helipad and uh, basically build his own prison. Crazy. This is Envigado. Envigado. See, Pablo Escobar, while living here. Say, hey, I need a special decoration of, of Envigado okay. in memory. And this is the original? Yeah. Yeah. This is the Fray Marianito. He, she, the name is Deborah Arango, artist. Ah, okay. okay. Born in Envigado. This, this is in, in memory of the Envigado. Okay, remember, he loved to Envigado. Yeah. Love born in Envigado. Yeah, so that was a so that was a tunnel, guys. Um, obviously it's closed up now, but that was an escape tunnel right there. The boys have got their helmets on it. And this is the helipad. I've seen this in many, many videos, pictures, documentaries. What a view! Beautiful. Beautiful natural. This is Medellin, the big river. Yeah. Medellin River. Okay. You look. The central area. So yes, this was his helipad. Enemies. Yeah, so he's high up, so he can see all the enemies. What a place, honestly. Uh, how did he get away with this? How did they let him do this? It's crazy. Beautiful day here, absolutely glorious. Look at that sky. So yeah, you can see all the paintings on the wall as we were just speaking about there. So these are all original from when he was here. Original rooms. Okay. Yeah. Well, 
no for Polish Corps member. Polish Corps in this area. Yeah. In the bodyguards. So the bodyguards area. had their own yeah. little rooms here. Yeah, in this area, the entrance of the cook is here. Yeah, so so guys, the entrance for the cook was here. They've now they've now closed it all off. He said the legend in this area, Polish Corps, the enemies, torturation and cut. Oh, so you used to take people in there and yeah, torture in this them? In this hmm. So the enemies of Polo Squad went kidnapped for maybe he say, hey, I need money. The people, yeah. it's cartoons. Oh, I don't know how more now. Ah, okay. Do, do you know visit to me? Oh, I go. Enemies, torturation. So, <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't like to end up in there. Used to play basketball and things in here. Yeah. And foot. And football. So yeah, I mean Sergio was just talking, they were saying basically it's a prison for the government, but a hotel for Pablo Escobar. And before Pablo Escobar barbecue area. Oh this was a barbecue okay. area? Yes. In this area, this road for communication, this entrance, and the back half the little stadium for game or player. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Football. Yeah. Okay. So they, it's in this area. Yeah. So this is all original. Original. Yeah. And I'll in this area barbecue for celebration. Yeah. My friends. So yes, this building here, the bottom of it, was the original administration for the prison. I say prison, it wasn't a prison. And the top of it, I don't know if it's new, I'm not quite sure what that is, but I know the bottom of it was the administration for the prison. It certainly wasn't a prison. Up there, in the, the so-called prison, there was casinos and areas, there used to be like bands and singers and stuff used to come up here because in that time it was either silver or lead as they say so it was either come and I'll pay you or you'll get a bullet so obviously you, you grew up here you grew up when Pablo Escobar was about I'm saying when Pablo Escobar was here you were you were living here no 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 nothing only journalists or, or police? No, I mean, so when Pablo Escobar was in the prison or the hotel, you were living in Medellin? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah in this yeah. epoch. And I remember very violence, the massacres. So it was a, a scary time? Si, pero in, in very, very massacres, violence. For we, normal. We well, say, ah, maybe in other countries, he's saying. Yeah. No, only Medellin. Yeah, yeah. yeah I understand the thing. So yes, it's easy to romanticise uh, Pablo Escobar and all of this, but you've got to remember that all this wealth was built on the back of the, the Colombian people uh, and their sacrifice. So I'm going to sign off here, guys. Stay tuned and I will see you tomorrow.